happening today, we could learn more about the disappearance and suspected death of Suzanne Morphew. Michaelia White joining us live from Denver's FBI headquarters. They've, of course, been helping with this investigation. Michaelia, we know there are a lot of questions around this case. So what are we hoping to learn exactly today? Well, Kelly, today an arrest affidavit could become unsealed in the case against Barry Morphew, the husband of Suzanne Morphew, and that could reveal more about why he is being charged with murder. Now, Monday marked one year since Suzanne was reported missing. She disappeared after leaving her home on a bike ride on Mother's Day of last year, and investigators say they don't believe Suzanne is still alive. Now, her body has not been found, but Barry Morphew is facing charges in connection with her disappearance. Those include murder after deliberation, tampering with physical evidence, and attempting to influence a public servant. Now, Barry's neighbors weighed in on an arrest shortly after it happened last week, saying everything seemed normal. Nothing out of the ordinary. No, you know, he hunted, he, you know, he, he had his trucks, and he, he, he did a lot of landscaping work. That was his profession that he told me. And, and so he'd do work around the, the neighborhood, you know, all this building behind us. So he's done a lot of work, a lot of contribution to, you know, to the projects, to the homes here. So, uh, yeah, nothing that would throw me off. And Barry Morphew remains in custody in Chafee County after he was arrested at his home last week near Poncha Springs. Of course, we will let you know if we learn any more going forward on this case today. For now, we're live in Denver. Michaela White covering Colorado First.